Hi, I'm Lily, and welcome to my Watch My Story YouTube channel. Please make sure to give us a like and subscribe so you get notified whenever we upload a new video. I'm 27 years old and my story is about my relationship and marriage. I'm pretty beautiful and elegant, so it doesn't matter where I go, guys would always ask me out on a date. But I'm smart too. I always go out with rich guys who are younger than me, so I can get my own benefit out of it. They always pay and buy many things for me, things that you can't even imagine. Expensive watches, brand bags, and they take me to luxury restaurants. About a year ago, I met a boy named David, who was about 8 years younger than me and was 19 years old himself. When I found out that his father was the vice president, I became friends with him. David did not look very good, and in general, everyone who saw us together would assume and tell themselves, he's probably rich, that's why she's dating him. I did not care much about these words. The only thing that mattered to me was David's money and that's all. And since David was young and wanted to be having all the attention for himself, to feel like he's a strong and an independent man so he can impress all these girls around him. On the other hand, it was great to be with David. We always had two bodyguards with us and wherever we went, they would follow us. But it was very obvious that I was way older than David. I would even say that I was more attractive. I also took the opportunity that David is not young and doesn't have enough experience. In addition, I used my beauty and looks to manipulate David, even though I knew how crazy David was for me. One day, when we went to a restaurant together, I told him, Honey, let's get married. You and I are meant to be together. Are you for real, darling? You want to get married? Yeah, let's do it and tie the knot, said David, who was overjoyed and pleased. Long story short, David went home and told the story to his parents. Apparently, his father got very furious and angry, and things were getting out of hands. But he told David that there was nothing wrong with it. However, he wanted to talk to me first. He got my number from David, and we set up a date to see each other in a restaurant. I went to the location that he sent for me and was waiting for him until he showed up. At first, he threatened me. Get the hell away from my son and leave your life. It is obvious that you're a gold digger. I said, you're wrong. I love David. We want to get married. Then his father said, I'll give you $5 million to leave my son alone and never talk to him ever again. When he said that, I shouted <gasps> with joy, $5 million? Are you kidding me? Am I on a camera? His father took out a check and wrote and signed a $5 million. Before giving it to me, he said, I'm giving this to you to get the hell out of David's life. But if I found out that you come back to him again for any reason, I'll make you miserable. I got the money and said, Uh, don't worry. After that night, I did not call David or answer his messages. I felt bad for him at first, not gonna lie. It was clear that I did not love him and his money was the only thing that mattered to me. I just got 5 million dollar right now, but I'm still going to be friends with wealthy boys who are too young to spend all of their money for me. Because I know they will be stupid and easy to use. You may judge me and say that I'm a gold digger, but they also want to be friends with a beautiful girl to sleep with her. So we conclude that I'm not doing anything wrong. Well, this was my story. Please leave a comment without judging me.